All right, how does it look? I know, it's goofy. <laughs> My face is much fatter now, but eh, I guess it's okay. Best part about hair, it grows back. I'm going to the solar eclipse thing. <laughs> Around here in the area where I live, the solar eclipse would be going through, but there's probably gonna be a lot of cloud coverage. So we're gonna have to go up north a little bit. So uh, yeah, I'm packing up for tonight just so that way I have some stuff because I'm going to be gone for a couple of days. Uh, we're thinking about going to St. Louis, Missouri to stay the night. Maybe go to the Arch, but the Arch is probably going to be full. And whenever we looked at some of the stuff on it, it said that it was pretty much going to be full anyway. So that may or may not happen. But um, we're at least going to try. And I would like to go to the Arch. I hadn't been there in a while, so... We may or may not be able to go, but it just, it, it all depends. It's just how everything goes for the day. But in the meantime, I got my blanket in there. I'm actually going to get me some more clothes real quick. Yeah, we're talking about going up to Illinois to some place. I don't even remember what the name of the place is, but I'll put it on the screen somewhere, wherever it is that we decided to go to. I've never been up there before. Got some extra socks, another pair of underwear, and some more pants. And then I also have my wonderful pair of pajama sweatpants, something or another, that I'm going to wear in the morning. I'm all nice and snug in a bug and a rug while we're going down the interstate or up the interstate, whatever it is. Yeah, we're going north. So, yeah, that's, that's up. North is up. South is down. And I'm going to take the laptop so that way I can work on some content, too. So I'm letting a lot of mother-flipping bugs into the shed right now. Uh, there's a lot of bugs that are going. <laughs> All right, it is 8.20, and I'd like to be down there by at least 9 or 9.30 to kind of get everything put into the other vehicle and kind of go from there. I am so exhausted. I woke up at 4 o'clock this morning <laughs> because I was thinking that I was going to record some videos to at least do something on the ride up there, but... I didn't end up doing that, but it's fine. I'm going to make some content on the way anyway, so. And by that, I mean I'm just going to vlog, and then I could just edit it while we're going, so. I'm working on getting things kind of prepared for me and then prepared for my dog, so that way my grandparents can watch Rocky for a couple of days. And then, uh, yeah, I'm going to get on the road. You know how usually schools do the... Uh, early morning pizzas like the breakfast pizzas or you go to the gas station and there's the breakfast pizzas and stuff like that available well i'm doing that this morning however it's just a regular pizza because i don't feel like doing the breakfast part of it but i did want something to eat and i thought it would be a good idea for me to get something to eat so i'm going to eat a regular pizza all right the pizza is completed but i'm going to do something a little bit controversial. I got some more McDonald's sauce that I found at another McDonald's that I was afraid that they wouldn't have it, but they were still advertising it. So I was like, hey, I need more of that McDonald's sauce. I got 13 of those bitches. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to peel this off. And instead of just having a bland ass, it doesn't even hardly look like it's cooked. Ah, oh, it's still cold. What the, f what the flip? All right, now that it's cooked a little more, Oh yeah, it doesn't even feel cold at all now. It is very hot now. <laughs> now we're going to drizzle some of this McDonald's sauce on top of the pizza. This is freaking cancer. <laughs> but I wanted to try it. I like the McDonald's sauce a lot. Probably a little too much, but I wanted to try it. No, oh, Jesus, I'm getting it all over my hand. <coughs> Bottoms up! I didn't really get a good bite. You know for a pizza that already has pizza, tomato-y sauce, and a lot of extra cheese because I put extra mozzarella cheese on it, adding the sweet chili is not that bad. All right, finally on the road, heading down to my buddy's house so that way I could get in the car with them and then we're gonna go up north. I didn't even realize it, and so I'm probably really embarrassed about it, especially if it came up on camera, but the bottom of my beard 
after I had shaved it or trimmed it up last night, I used a regular razor and tried to make sure it was evened up, but I was doing it very blindly and it looked very bad. So I had to go back, get the razor, and then trim it back up again. So now it, it's it's a lot better. But yeah, that, that looked so goddamn bad. <laughs> I'm so glad I caught that. Otherwise, I'd look like a fucking idiot the entire time. That would have been embarrassing. But anyway, heading on down there now. And uh, yeah, we're going to get this uh, road trip on the road. Say you like blankets too much. Oh my god. There's a lot of people. Only $38. Oh no! I'm already breaking things. Ah, uh, it's fine. They have enough money to fix it. Here you go. Here's a collectible bobblehead. Delivers miles and miles of wiggles and smiles. That's crazy. Because I like that. What's the difference? Yeah, this sliced. Mine's a chopped brisket sandwich. I didn't notice until... Yeah, mine's sliced. Damn good brisket. What was... Oh, yours was pulled pork? Yeah. She's not pulled pork because she, she's not a fan of brisket. I'm garlic. I kind of don't want to just reach my fingers in there. It's all good. You're not screwed. Promise I don't have anything. Yeah, come on. Not bad. I do agree though, they could be colder and they would be better. I'll try a little bit of everything. I'll try chips and stuff after I eat the sandwich. I'm doing it all. Hmm. Pretty good. Uh, I think your honey's pretty good. Oh. Bag is kind of good. Yeah, they they look almost identical to the sweet and spicy Doritos. Whoa. Very similar. They're pretty good. Mm -hmm. I didn't expect tortilla chip though. Me neither. I like the circles in it. <laughs> right. Ooh, a hint of lime at the end. Almost. That is a long ass one. <laughs> that is a sausage. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's just what it. You want Damn. to taste it? It's smoked sausage. Kielbasa, basically. <laughs> that's a hell of a sausage right there. Not bad. 
I think I like sausage better than the brisket, honestly. Mm -hmm. I don't even need a tortilla. You could have just not put that on there. Yeah, I don't mm -hmm. I'm getting a mix of flavors. I just put in the jerky while still having that in my mouth. Very interesting flavor to it. <laughs> Hey, I'm in standstill traffic. I'm gonna get a picture. So how big's the highway up there? Uh, right now we're one, two, three, four lanes, five lanes with the exit lane across. What the? I probably could have got more taste out of dirty dishwater than that. Oh, hello. I had a little friend over here. Hey, how are you doing? I would feed you, but then you wouldn't leave this room. And I don't want you in here. I'm really getting anything out of this. I don't think you have it yet. Oh, I. Bonus guarantee you got the minimum. Nice. All right. Well, at least I got four bucks. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, only five bucks. It's all right. I'll take it. Like I found another Mountain Dew that I haven't tried yet. Time to do the taste test of Purple Thunder. Kind of weird. All right, we're going to our back alley hotel parking lot. <laughs> this is so sketchy, dude. At the Lot of Water. Lot of Water Creek. Good morning. It is almost 5.30 in the morning. Why am I awake right now, you may ask? I don't know. I don't know why I'm awake right now. <laughs> no, I, I couldn't sleep anymore. It something I guess either my body just can't handle doing the extra sleep or something, but it, it's, yeah, it, I'm exhausted. <laughs> waiting until the time is right for us to get going i knew i couldn't sleep anymore so i figured i'd come down here take some stuff over to the car and kind of get things situated and then whenever they're up then they can just grab their stuff and we can go i do still have a couple other things up there in the room but i really don't want to keep going back and forth up there and waking them up I'd much rather them sleep especially because one of them is the driver first night in illinois first day in Illinois <laughs> never been here before you guys have a very interesting state <laughs> oh wow I could put filters on here oh start a poll I don't want to start a poll what do I want to start a poll for do you think Illinois is a nice place yes or no <laughs> whoa 
Holy shit. <laughs> God damn. You can recline in this bitch. Wow. Oh, okay. Now I'm just going to go upside down. Oh, blood's rushing to my head. Oh, God. Yeah, I've never thought about, like, seeing eclipses. Honestly, that never really crossed my mind. But these friends that I'm with, uh, they said that seeing an eclipse was pretty cool. So, yeah, there's the dawn here. You know what? You know what? I'm going to give everyone bubbles. Splash, splash, I'd be taking a bath. It was a very interesting experience staying at this hotel. So we got a broken chair in the room, which I'm, I'm going to try to record some of that just to put in the vlog, just to be like, all right. So we get this high dollar room and then there's a broken office chair. That, and like, I couldn't help but laugh about it yesterday. It was so funny. The office chair is missing an entire half of a leg on the on the bottom. The netting on the back of the chair is all sorts of screwed up. You sit in it and like it leans back real weird like and it's like you're about to fall out of it. It's a very sketchy chair. There's not a lot of lights in the room. You turn on the light and it's just one tiny little light in front of the door. No other lights unless you use the lamps in the room. And it's like, okay, well, I guess I didn't want to be able to see. So that's fine. Things are just so jank in this hotel. Oh, and then our ice and vending area just has the ice machine. The ice machine, I, I wouldn't even trust that because it's like very, it's very sketchy. There, there's no vending machine. It's like maybe there was a vending machine at some point in time, but the vending machine is just not there anymore. Maybe someone stole the vending machine. I don't know. Who knows, maybe I'll just take a nap here in the car for a bit and then I'll wake up at 8.30 and be like, oh yeah, it's time to go back in, get some more stuff. Well, I'm I'm gonna go to the abyss and we will see you guys. Oh God, oh man, that's just so much work. Yeah, we're going to the abyss. And then where the tents are, you can see where all the telescopes are set up and they're ready to go. Uh, Southern Illinois University has contingent of... Even at 10 times in video mode, 4K60, that is amazing. That's crazy. I'm just about there. <laughs> yeah. The saturation is already different. Yeah, it's it's a weird. It's some weird shit. That's what told you you have to experience it in person. I, I'm wondering. Yeah, you can't really even tell in your camera either, like if it's changing. It'll probably get there though. I don't even have to wear sunglasses. <laughs> Nothing changes in like your camera. Like just seeing the video part from this camera, it looks like it's a normal day. But then you're looking out here like, whoa. Yeah. The sky is all like a purplish color now. Yeah, because you said as soon as it happens, I can just remove this, right? Yep, as soon as the uh, diamond ring goes away, which you'll know what that is, you can take that off. Holy crap, dude, it is dark. <laughs> the temperature just dropped like four degrees. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play this back on the laptop and get a still of whenever the event happens. Yeah. So. That is wild. <laughs> Time for bed, guys. <laughs> Man, it got chilly. Yeah, that is crazy. Here it comes. All right. 
comes the diamond ring. About 10 seconds. Holy crap. Yep, there it was. I just barely oh, got it. Wow. Woo! That is wild. <laughs> That is crazy. Yeah, we're just about... Oh, that's so cool. Yeah! <laughs> okay, that's perfect. Yeah, you can't even tell that it's dusk. Oh, wow, yeah. Just like you could tell the entire difference. All right, we're back home. That was awesome. <laughs> I will admit, that was probably the coolest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. And probably one of the coolest things that, well, no, there's going to be a lot cooler things, but that that's like top tier <laughs> for sure but yeah that was an awesome experience and if you didn't get to see it i would definitely recommend if you guys ever get to see another one if one ever happens to show up in your lifetime i would definitely recommend going and seeing it and if you did see it i hope you enjoyed it as well but yeah i'm gonna hang out here uh i'm gonna finish this video i gotta try and put this as an outro because i had a couple of videos as an outro, but apparently I didn't want to save it, so I'm doing this now. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. We'll see you in the next video. Like and subscribe, press the bell, become a member if you'd like, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye! Bye-bye now, bye-bye! Bye-bye!